guys, Amanda here, and in this video, I am going to be reacting to Bachelor in Paradise Season 7, Episode 11, aka the season finale, and I kind of know a bit of the outcome of this, however, I don't know how it all went down, all the drama, and so, especially this Noah and Abigail thing is really shocking me. Let's see how this thing ends and how they get to their ending and where they are now. Uh, and I'm also going to be drinking this Angry Orchard Hard Fruit Cider Strawberry. So yeah, I think I have, I have another one I might drink too. So we'll see. I had one already earlier, but that was a long time ago. Right now it's, what time is it? It's 3.52 a.m. So I'm gonna be going to sleep at like 6 a.m. <laughs> oh. <laughs> This episode's long, but it's okay. Don't worry about it. Who will get engaged? Is that Kendall? Kendall. I know, so cute. I know, so cute. <gasps> no playa mita for the promise. It wouldn't be a paradise prom. It wouldn't be a prom without someone prom. You know? But I don't know how it's gonna be. Abigail. I just realized in my previous video, I forgot to like say everything happened at the end because I think I just forgot to write it all down because I was watching it. About her taking off the corsage and walking off. If you knew you were feeling that way, you don't say that. That's how I felt. I mean, that's why this is hard. I feel like I'm not walking away with regrets. This is still so sad. <laughs> Even though I know, spoiler alert, that they're together now, but like, oh. I feel like I, if I watched this when this actually aired, I, I, I would have been crying. I would have cried because I wouldn't know that they were actually together. Like that they reconciled. But I wonder how that rec reconciliation went. It didn't work out, but it's still a chapter. But there's another chapter. <laughs> Noah told Abigail he was falling in love with her last night. So I did not see that coming. I feel like right? Really no, 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 no. He should be. Not you. Yeah. He just literally dumped her and bounced. That's not cool. <laughs> Noah, you got some splaining to do to Abigail's friends. Does someone go and like pack their stuff up for them or? That's something he needs to figure out on his own. True. I can't really tell they are gonna leave together. Me too. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Everything's okay, everything's alright. Man, I think, I think that, that would have broke me if I actually saw that when it originally aired. Yeah, yeah. So much for a last hurrah. Abigail and Noah were one of the strongest couples. Maybe. What, I forgot their show cocktail party. So oh my god. <laughs> is the fifth cocktail party. Oh. Yeah, I have some news that you guys probably <gasps> don't want to hear. Oh no. I'm gonna cancel the cocktail party. <gasps> well then. Joe. Hmm, who's Joe gonna pick? I wonder. Serena. <gasps> Joe and I have not had that glow time yet. Oh. So I'm excited. Ed. Ed. I knew it. Oh, look who's on the lips. Chelsea, Natasha, sorry. You're not receiving oh, rose. Take a moment and say your Bye, guys. Hi, Chelsea. Really hard. I don't trust myself enough. Natasha, just don't 
don't date Bachelor Nation. You're too good for Bachelor in Paradise, Natasha. Can we get Natasha for Bachelorette, please? Here's me telling Natasha she's too good for Bachelor in Paradise. <laughs> for Bachelor Nation, I can't speak. There's been so much and then I tell her so Bachelorette. But. but cheers to that and still being here with each other. Yes. <laughs> cheers. This week. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Wells. Rose Palapa. Got a big announcement, okay? The Palapa. I like the oh Palapa. <laughs> Got some friends who know exactly how you feel in this moment. Ooh, 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 ooh. You guys ready? <gasps> See Oh, Dean and Kaylin, I wasn't expecting them. Not a day goes by that I'm not grateful for Paradise for bringing us together. I feel the same way. I feel like he's like reading a script. No more new arrivals. No more date cards. No more distractions. Paradise is over. Which he kind of is, I think. Yeah, it just sounds like they're like, they like had a script and they just memorized it. Because it doesn't seem organic what they're saying, but. You realize that it's time to make it's those like decisions. The stuff that's that always gets said. The rest of your life. Like I personally was caught off guard. I get it. You know. This, Why were you caught off guard? You knew it was about serious. to you end. Know, you don't want to play with someone. You feeling. just had the prom. I know you should. You know, surprise me in all the best ways, but I feel like mm -hmm. sometimes you said a but. it's too good to be true. And although it does make sense to me. Oh, Thomas. It's a decision you have to make. You see that side? I'm gonna trust you. It's gonna suck. <laughs> Thomas. But I don't want you to leave here with what you. No, wait. wait. Thomas! Wait! Wait! Is she running after him? Think she changed her mind? I don't know. Wow. That is not what I was expecting. I was expecting them to leave together because I know spoiler alert that they're together now unless they broke up like yesterday or today or something I don't know but yeah wow <laughs> we know who they are Ari and Garrett. Wait, you didn't see it from your fiance for two years? You didn't see that at all? Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, how much I like her in such a short time. You look good, just take a deep breath. Ed is so precious. Hopefully, uh, I'll see you soon with some good news. Classic Ed. <laughs> to try to go to the fantasy suite with, with a girl that he... He just met yesterday. <laughs> 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 Fantasy suite sounds amazing with McKenna. How's it going? Ed. Like, I don't think that I can be what you were looking for. But I feel a really strong spark with you. Yeah. And yeah. I want to <laughs> explore like what that spark looks like outside of paradise. Ed. Like we started the spark, and so it's like it would be a waste to say. You know, let's just turn it off and see ya. Nice meeting you. Hey, man, he making his case right now. No blame giving this. <laughs> yeah, and, uh, I'm not letting you go. Who knows? Maybe he'll scoop on. <sighs> Leave here today and know that we're gonna like make some plans to see each other. Yeah, I would love to do that. I just think that. <sighs> wasn't an easy decision. I mean, I'm not shocked by that, but I'm shocked by how into it Anna was. Anna should be on next season of Paradise from the beginning. 
Because I feel like she'll either find someone right away and like they'll be really strong or better outcome is that she'll just be, she'll just be very unlucky and just be comedic relief. Sorry, Anna, but yeah. We came in together, we got a ride out together. You trying to head back to SD? <laughs> let's do it, bro. Let, let's get out here, bro. Let's oh get my here. god. I know we hung out. Oh, she's gonna do it right there? Yeah, we have to do this fast. James is waiting right now, so we're about to bounce back to the SD. Are you <laughs> me right now? Go with the boys when you're in SD. I'll get your number. I hate you. I hate him. I hate him. Are you with me right now? You're, you're kidding. This is a joke. Wait, what? Why am I surprised? So many of them live in San Diego. Yo, big love story. That's the way the cookie crumbles. That's the way the cookie crumbles. Next year, we'll, they're gonna have a televised wedding. This place, this beach, <laughs> these dudes, I'm never coming here again. I'm leaving single. No more men. <laughs> dudes, I'm out of here. Bye, Tia. See you never, paradise. I love Tia. I doubt she'll come back to paradise. Cause I think she's in a relationship right now, but hey, you never know. She's really funny, so hope she comes back at some point. At least to like, I don't know. It's guest host scary or something. Seeing how we're literally dropping like flies. This is something like we want to continue. Get the words out. I don't even know what he's gonna say. Well, I guess all I'm gonna say is I'm gonna love you though. a heart attack over there. There's something that's been on my chest and I really need to talk about it. <gasps> What's been on your chest? Do you have a necklace on your chest? Is that what it is? This is you they make me smile. The guy that's watching the speech that's given me butterflies. <gasps> I was going to say that later. Are you saying that now? <laughs> <laughs> been having grown up talks before. I'm excited about fantasy suites with Serena, but at the same time, I'm in on her in the tarot Wait. Hmm. Let's be like that. <laughs> wow. They all look so amazing. <laughs> we said we were falling in love with each other. Better than real. More to me than. But you know, since you know meeting you and, and getting to know you and spending so much time with you, um, you know I've really. She says you I know a lot, I, but I, I do too. I came here for, but and, um, I, I cut just, out of my I videos have such a, a lot. Good about this and about us. Uh -huh. and, um, <laughs> loves Kenny. <laughs> Kenny loves Mari. Yeah. <laughs> that was cute. Literally... And that's it. We'll be chilling, and eventually, when wakes up, she comes down and she plays with us. And, you know, for me, it's just quality time. It's supposed to be romantic and I'm making like <laughs> weird faces. When I see you, you know, I see Sunday morning. Which That's cute. Feels. I love you too. Yeah, come here. Well, we know how this ends. It's almost too good to be true. Oh, I want some whipped cream and strawberries. So oh, that looks so good. <laughs> oh, I want one of those tacos. Enjoy yourselves. <laughs> you don't know Amy? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I guess 
get out of here with that. I can see that. I'm trying to throw her off. They didn't spend that much time with those two. Like the, the other two couples. Maybe because they're trying to build that like uncertainty with them. As Riley was saying goodbye this morning. You know, after all the dust has settled from the overnight. Ken is so hot. Waking up today is a, a bit of a reality. Sorry. Thing. I'm excited. Oh my gosh, I love her dress. It's so beautiful. Best day of my life so far. But her hair is nice and like, got that like curl wave to it. I don't know if it was love at first sight, uh, but it was definitely something. Uh, something I've never felt before. I don't know if it was love at first sight, but it was something at first sight. <laughs> will you marry me? I will. Oh my god. It's big, right? It's huge. Yeah. Good job. <laughs> yeah. That's huge. Looks like it's too big, but they can resize it. Even though they should have a ring size. <laughs> he asked Mari to marry her. Wait. <laughs> Wait, he asked Mari to marry him. <laughs> We're engaged, but I don't accept your rose, no. Sorry. We're getting engaged. We're getting? You are. We are engaged. He's a mess. But probably because he's so happy. Who's next? Riley and Marissa? Yep, I was right. Oh, I like the little like pantsuit thing she's got going on. That's really cute. I need to see more of Kaylin's dress. The first I wasn't about it, but then I saw like more different colors on like the sleeves. It's like, oh, or the straps. I knew I loved you the first night that I met you. Wow. And I've loved you since our very first day. I like that they said the same thing to each other. Oh. I got the shivers, sorry. It always bothers me that the girls have to like work to put their roses on, but the guys are like, here you go. Like, come on. I don't like that. I like I'd like poke myself with that thing. Just give everybody the long stem roses. That's what I liked from the Australian Bachelorette uh, when she had guys and girls as contestants and the guys got the long roses. Everybody got the long roses. They should just do it all the time. Bachelor, Bachelorette, doesn't matter who the contestants are, men, women, they should just all get the long roses and yeah, no more. Today I woke up just feeling super excited because let me get another drink. I feel like I need it. Joe and I, we just truly love each other and the world that I love him. She's coming. That's Kendall. Here we go. That's Kendall. Kendall, get out of here. What are you doing? Joe's like, well, fuck. <laughs> hey there. Oh, you left a few weeks ago. I just think you're a catch. And I think you always will be. That wasn't necessary though. They just did that for dramatic effect. That was not necessary. Especially, I felt like the hardest person that's gonna be on is Kendall. Like that was, ugh. They didn't need to do that at all. Hope they gave her some extra money for that. Ugh. Ugh. Joe's having second thoughts. No, he's not having second thoughts. No, I think he's just trying to get in the right headspace because I think he's just feeling really bad and really guilty about about being able to move on and she's not quite there yet. I think that's what's going on with him. I started to doubt if I was going to really be able to get there with someone. Girl, you're 23, okay? She's 
she's like 40. Max did just show up on the beach. No, she was yeah. there. Yeah, that just happened. Are you okay? Yeah. Oh, well, you're married. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, she's just. Cheers! What's this? Oh, this, I forgot he came in naked. <laughs> oh my god. Tash won! Can she have her own show? I would totally watch that. Oh, right! The kick in the fire! <gasps> Liam! James and Aaron are now roommates in BFFs. Hashtag Big Facts. Demi got as good and says the haters can blank her ass or something. Connor is available to play your next event. Taj can't wait to return to paradise to find love. Good. <laughs> she moved to Los Angeles and now vaccinated. Good. Tia is still looking for the right dance partner. Kelsey has radiant skin and is regular. David is expecting happy birthday videos from the entire cast. Noah and Abigail left paradise and realized they missed each other. They are hanging out and taking things slowly. Becca and Thomas started dating again after paradise. They are happy and in love. Brandon and Piper are laying low. Natasha has over 460,000 followers on Instagram. Kenny and Mari's love is insatiable. Aww. Just like Kenny's love of eating Mari's tacos. Riley and Marissa have lived part of Riley's dream and are madly in love. Not anymore! Joe and Serena are happily engaged. She's excited to become a grocer's wife. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hello. I like this little montage. It's cute. Ooh. I still have to watch this season. All right, let's see, let's see. We found something that was actually really alarming. Someone is planning out a very happy move. That was the end. All right. So I got, you know, even though I knew how everything was going to end up, there were still some surprises. Like I didn't know that Becca and Thomas didn't leave together. I thought maybe that they were just going to, they weren't going to go to the fantasy suites, but that they were going to be like, you know what? We're not ready for the fantasy suites yet, but we still like each other. Let's leave together, see how things go. I wasn't expecting them to um, break up them in paradise. And then Kendall coming. Well, I guess I saw that in a preview from last time, so I knew that. But that was, you know, that was nice. Uh, I was kind of, that was, well, no, that was not nice. That was not nice. I was not nice to her. I feel like they kept her around. They were like, all right, if they end up engaged, we're gonna keep you around, and then you're gonna go onto the beach and say what you need to say and to create more drama on the show. It was nice to see Kaylin and Dean, even though everything that they said was very scripted. I wish uh, we got some nice like interviews from them, some more real moments from them. I think I'll, I will watch all of The Bachelorette and then I'll make a little like review video of what I thought about the big moments and things and yeah I think I'll do that same thing with The Bachelor then I'll be caught up and then I will hopefully be good to go for the next season of The Bachelorette if they do it at the same time that they usually do. I will miss Bachelor in Paradise. Now I have a challenge to do my videos of challenge so those will be happening soon and yeah all right uh thank you guys so much for watching i appreciate you all and i hope you have a wonderful day a wonderful week a wonderful month a wonderful year and a wonderful life right goodbye i have my um engagement ring that i proposed to myself with it's a hair tie but you know it looks good all right bye